Hello everyone, Let you are here and welcome back to the channel. Today I'm bringing you an exciting new video that's going to take your Figma game to the next level. That's right, it's time to level up your UI design skill and take your workflow to new heights. I've got some killer tips and tricks that I can't wait to share with you. Let's boost our design workflow in Figma and create some amazing design together. Are you ready to elevate your design game? Let's go! The first tip is how to select a specific layer in a frame. As designers, when we are working with a frame with multiple layers and we want to select a particular layer within another layer, it's sometimes challenging. You mostly have to double click into layers till thy kingdom come. But did you know there is a way to overcome that demonic process? Haha, <laughs> yeah. So the thing is, holding on the control key on the windows, right click on the layer you want to select and a menu will open so you can choose the element you wish to edit. We all know that pressing the C key on your keyboard will allow you to add comments to an object. However, with the comments icon selected, Holding down control while clicking the left mouse button and moving the mouse will enable you to make an area for comments. You can use this tip to leave a comment for developers on more than one design element during a design handoff. Closed captioning is a feature that was released not long ago and is only available on the desktop version of Figma. With this feature, you can talk with people in Figma and it will add captions to help you understand them better. It mostly helps if the other person has a heavy accent or is in a noisy place. To turn this feature on, on your Figma homepage, navigate to your profile icon and click on the drop down arrow. Click on settings and in the new features section, you will see closed captions beta. Now toggle enable closed captioning when using audio inside your files. Figma works really well on a cloud, and whenever we are working on a file, we don't need to worry about constantly saving our files because Figma automatically saves our files. But if you have trust issues and just want a local copy of your file, head to menu, select file, and select save local copy. Here you can create a folder on your computer called maybe Figma offline files, and you can save your files there. Moving on to how to save specific version history of your file, Figma has this cool feature where you can save a particular version of a file. This feature is useful when you are running some tests and you want to come back to a particular version of your design. To access this time travel feature, head to the menu, select file and click on save to version history. Or you can use the keyboard shortcut Ctrl Alt S. To access the version history, use a keyboard shortcut Ctrl Alt S and select Show Full Version History. Now on the right side menu, you will see the version history we created. You can duplicate, share a link or delete the version. Adding a file as a favorite doesn't seem like a huge tip, but trust me, it's helpful, for instance, when you mark a UI kit as a favorite and you are working on a design system. It becomes easy to access the UI kit. It's also very easy to add a file as a favorite. With your Figma file opened, head to the toolbar where you have the name of your file, click on the drop-down menu icon and select Favorites this file. You can also remove a file as a favorite. Now, when you head to the main menu, your favorite file will have a star on it. Our final tip is a handy one to know. Assuming you want to quickly change the color of an object and you don't want to open the color palette menu, you can directly type the name of the color in the color hex inputs field. You can type red and the object's fill color changes to red. All right guys, we are almost done here, but before we go, drop your favorite tip in the comments. And if you love this video, hit the like button, leave a comment and don't forget to subscribe for more. See you in the next one. Bye.